Well, folks, it's about that time. You put these guys in the room with no powers, just hands. Who's coming out the winner? All right, let's break it down. Now, Asta would be more physically inclined than damn near everybody on this list. But I have never seen Asta in a hand-to-hand -hand fight, so I'd say he's out. Deku without powers is also out because there's only so much he can do with his intelligence. I would say that Mikey would be out next because he doesn't really match up to the others in physicality and skill. Now, ultimately, it comes down to Boruto and his training in the arts of Taijutsu and the Gentle Fist. It's not like Boruto has not been countered by people who are bigger than him, which is why he uses diversion and tactics whenever he fights because he makes up for his diminutive stature. You still have to remember that he is still a kid. You also have to understand that his combat is real dependent on Shadow Clone Jutsu. Tanjiro definitely has the physicals and the speed to hit way harder than Boruto. Tanjiro has also gone up against encountered very adept fighters as well. Megami has already stated that if everyone from both academies jumped Itadori with no powers, he would still win. Most of these people he's talking about are more experienced than Itadori, so I'd give it to him.